today is the 13th, as you will know, and the 13th was forecasted to be a very big day for CCIV stock and Lucid Motors, because Lucid Motors is having a little bit of a conference today. We spoke about this in our video both yesterday and in a bit more detail in our one on Sunday. But yeah, that is happening today. So far, we have not seen any movement really uh, regarding that and, you know, focusing on the share price because the share price has been down ever so slightly. It's down by about 3.09%, which is quite a bit, don't get me wrong. But obviously, when we do focus in on that growth that we have seen in the past five days, it is not as bad. We can see on the past five days, we had this downtrend on Wednesday of last week and a bit more uh, going forwards into Thursday, but mainly from Thursday onwards, we are still in the green. So here we had a big push up on Monday yesterday. Now we are seeing a bit of a sell off, but obviously we are still up in the past four or so days. And you do have to be asking yourself, why is the share price not moving as much as anticipated based on the news which is going on today and the hype that we are seeing? So overall today, I actually ant anticipated it being quite a red day. And I said this even for yesterday. I thought because of what is going on with CCIV and Lucid Motors and the potential for dilution, I thought people were going to be bearish on this one uh, in the short term. And I thought we were going to see a little bit of a drop in share price because of that. And don't get me wrong, guys. In this video, we are not covering the conference. We are just covering how the stock has been moving based on that so far. So again, coming, coming forward into where we are right now, we've seen a big bearish candle. Handle, but again, today has been red so far. Anyway, we're going to be having a little bit of a look and a bit more depth at how the stock has been moving in this video. Make sure to leave a like on it and subscribe if you haven't already. Again, this is not financial advice. It's just my personal opinion. But if you want to hear it, this is the place for it. Join us on Twitter at N2S Finance. You guys will know I give regular updates over there. And I also talk about posts from our website called Markets Daily. You can find the link to that in the description. We will be publishing a new article on CCIV, hopefully today. Uh, regarding the conference and all that sort of stuff and again we do have a patreon link to that is down below as well so we're going to focus in now on the more simple charts and again do remember this is just a look at how the share price has been moving over the past day or so and when we go into the past day we can see a clear trend for cciv and i will outline that right now so from 9 uh, 9 30 we can see that the stock price has been dipping quite a lot we came down from highs in the morning of about 27 and 5 all the way down to the 25 dollar range so it really was a big drop as you would expect and again we saw a bit of a pump yesterday in price which i was a bit you know confused about because we were potentially seeing some bad news today for cciv or some news which people may regard as negative so i was confused confused as to why we had a rise on Monday but anyway that is what happened for the context on yesterday so so far from Monday where we started off we can see that from Friday we are still up and again Monday saw a big push up in price and that continued for the majority of the day but Tuesday did take away most of those gains so again, if you'd have bought this one on Friday, you'd be ever so slightly in the green, but so far today on Tuesday, we are seeing a day in the red. Now, as I mentioned in just a few moments ago, we are still seeing a lot of consolidation throughout the day, as you can tell, but we are seeing a little bit of a drop off right now towards the end of the day. Again, this may be because people aren't very happy on how the stock has been moving and because a lot of people do view the potential of more shares being issued as a bearish sign. And I've spoken about this before, gave my personal opinions on this. I don't think it is as bearish for long long-term investors because this company is a pre-revenue company they're going to need to get money to fund their business somehow and right now it does make sense kind of to issue more shares and as I spoke about I do believe that for long-term investors this will just be a blip hopefully in the company's very prosperous future but for short-term investors I think this probably will hurt them because we definitely are in my opinion if we do see more shares be out there we definitely are going to see a bit of a drop in price one because people may view it as negative and again we are seeing a bit of a sell-off today potentially because of that and two because obviously more shares out there means that each share will be worth ever so slightly less but yeah that is what we are seeing so far today with the price of cciv so so far we are seeing an rsi figure of 25 and again that is accounting for that drop that we have just seen so it is going back up but yeah 25 so far up to 30 now but 25 into 30 is pretty low bear in mind guys 20 itself is going to be oversold so 27 really is quite close to being oversold but it is just not there yet uh, we can see a moving average figure of about 26 and 14 we are coming ever so slightly below that again as you would expect because we have just seen that massive drop in price the past five days you can see this trend upwards over all as i mentioned but yeah we are seeing a little bit of a drop right now which means that the moving average is ever so slightly higher at 26.18 and we are seeing an rsi figure down here of 36 so again still very much towards the oversold side but definitely not there yet 
Now, the past month is where things get interesting. We get a bit more perspective on this stock. So, seeing a moving average figure of about 22.7, we are seeing a, sh a share trade volume today of about 7.49 million, and the RSI figure is at 54. We are seeing a MACD trend, which is maybe starting to turn bearish. Again, today was a bearish day, as you can tell, and this is actually dipping ever so slightly. So, yes, this definitely could be going bearish in the future. We were seeing a little bit of a trend reversal after these three days. Of bullish candles but again today being red it just didn't mean that we managed to break up a little bit higher it meant that we did continue to drop so we'll have to see what does happen going forwards i think that tonight is going to be quite crucial i think going forwards into tomorrow is going to be quite crucial as well and we do still have a little bit of time before the market does close so you know anything could happen in that time period but that is what we're seeing today with the price action of ccv again this one is not looking at the investor conference so if people are going to comment that down below that was not the intention of this video we definitely may do that tomorrow and analyze what has been said but this one i just wanted to look at the price of the stock so thank you for watching through till the end but let me tell you about our discord so on your screen you will be seeing the n2s finance discord obviously it is split into multiple sections basically at the top we have updates from me and all that kind of good stuff if you scroll down a bit further we have the main sections where we focus on cryptos spacs and other hot stocks including penny stocks even stable growth stocks as well and we even have a special amc gme chat if you scroll down you can see some research and dd from the community we also have funny memes and you can see actual contributions from many members down here and again if you do join us it is a completely free link is down below but if you do want to become a patreon you will actually get a pink uh, sticker which will be displayed on your name so your name will come up in pink as mine comes up in red down here and that will show that you are a patreon but other than that guys you can join completely for free down below you do not have to pay anything if you do not want to thank you for watching see you soon